package from H&M. Uh, it can't really be longer than this, otherwise I look very uh, short. Um, it is completely transparent. Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am Lamia and this is The Lamb Style and today we are going to try some clothes from H&M. Why H&M? H&M because I've seen everywhere people wearing some really nice pieces from H&M and I kind of still have this old idea of H&M being not that good of a brand, like not good quality, not, you know, just not nice pieces, just like basic stuff. So I couldn't avoid it, but today I am trying some new stuff with you. So what I have done is that I am a bit lazy so I'm not dressed up because I'm not going to dress up to also take off my clothes to try stuff for you. So I'm not doing that. I'm that lazy. But also it's raining outside so I can't do film. I can't film stuff on my balcony like I did the last time. But we are going to try to do everything on this very restricted area so we're going to do it all in here but first let me show you quickly the package it's quite a big package so i don't know if i can lift it this is the package from each of them oh, <laughs> this is it it's quite heavy um okay so first item i am just going to open try and tell you exactly what works for me for my body shape and I'll give you the sizing and I'll give you also the price if I remember the price. So, first thing is a bit of a trench coat. I was looking into the, they have, H&M has like a, a premium brand into their brand where it's a bit more, um, how can I say it? It's better fabric, better cut, better stuff. So that's where I bought my, most of my things from because I just wanted it to be a bit of a elevated look you know so first let's start by opening this okay so as you can see this is the coat all right it does need a bit of steam in so if you get this kind of trench you would need a lot of steam in all the time you know um it has a, a belt on the back which i like um it is what you need to know about this coat. I'm going to get closer so that you can see how it looks like. So, this is not your regular um, trench coat fabric. This is a bit softer, a bit more... It's not like, you know how the trench coats are a bit stiff and that it's it done on purpose so that the uh, coat has a shape and keeps its shape. This one is softer, you know. Um, it is very soft. It it is 100% recycled polyester. This is my setup, by the way, so that you can see me. It's quite dark here. So, yeah. Um, I like the length of it. It works really well for my um, for my height. Uh, it can't really be longer than this. Otherwise, I look very uh, short. And even shorter than this would look actually great like this. Would look actually great, which is what I found at Burberry. They do that length. Um, yeah. I mean, it's not bad. I like the fabric of it, but I feel like there are small details that are missing, like the detail on the, like if there was a bit of a belt around the uh, sleeve, it would look nicer, chicer. They have a bit of a detail here on the shoulder. But I do like the fabric of it, even though you have to steam it all the time. But this is uh, lighter, you know. So as you can see, I'm not lying to you. This is Europe size 40. Okay, so I'm just going to show you this so that you can have a reference for the sizing. I'm usually size large. Okay, so this next item is a dress. Please don't focus on the Levi's shoe and <laughs> socks. So this dress, I love that because it looks like a knitted dress, but apparently it's a knitted dress with a bit of a pleat and it's a bit stretchy. It's a lot stretchy as you can see. I love the fact that it's stretchy this much, but at the same time, it is transparent. So I'm wearing something underneath. This is not my skin. Uh, so I'm definitely wearing stuff underneath to just cover up. <laughs> but it is still very transparent. Um, yeah, as you can see, look. Um, it is completely transparent. Apart from that, I just love the shape of it. I love the neck. It looks completely 
like my style and yeah I just I have a problem with the fact that it's transparent the length also is quite cool and this is size large and yeah it's, oh, it's a shame it's transparent because I really like it it comes also in other colors and this is size large and um, well size large this is knitted I don't know if you know that a brand called uh, uh, Isaya Miyake and they have another brand also called uh, Pleats Please they do this kind of like pleated you know chic kind of clothes so this is gives that same vibe that is completely transparent <laughs> so next item it's this top it is a top that has a bit of a, a snitch around the waist I do that because that makes you look slimmer around the waist so as you can see I love this it's very classic it has a satiny feel it's a size large also uh, the neck is uh, very loose uh, as you can see and I love the you know the satiny look of it this could be a really good one to wear for dinner if you want to just feel comfortable and casual at the same time a bit of an elevated look um, yeah I love also the sleeves let me show you the sleeves um, The sleeve also, you can wear it like this, um, and it's very large sleeve, it's very comfortable to be honest with you. It does feel, um, it does feel of a different quality than what I have tried earlier. It does feel like a nice quality, and the cut is quite nice. Um, yeah, as you can see, it's quite a cool one, I like it. I definitely love this one. Really nice one, this is size large, did I say that? Yeah, size large. Okay, more of a casual look. As you can see, this sweater says Paris plus Vendôme. This is size large. It has a bit of a detail in here. As you can see, I think on both sides, no, just one side. Um, you can see the detail down here. It is a nice, it is a nice um, sweater. I think this size is quite big. This is size large. I would definitely get size medium um, because that's my usual size. But I wanted to oversize it, but it looks too oversized. What do you think? Because I don't like when the sleeves go down like that. Yeah, the next one is this trousers. Let me just show you. It looks pretty cool, has pocket the fabric is quite soft so this is size 40 europe 12 uk i think 8 us but it has like an illusion of having a bracket but it's not and also doesn't have any pockets on the back but i like oops i like the width of it um and also i like the color i just want to show you the color it just has these thin thin stripes and it's grey, dark grey, just love it, also it has an elastic on the top so you feel comfortable wearing it, this is my bloated stomach because I just had some bread, <laughs> so yeah it looks quite, it looks quite good, I, I'm keeping it and I think I need to also alter it because I love to wear my trousers with flat shoes so I definitely need to alter it, this one goes back and get it and I'll get it in a smaller size. Here's the thing, I am fascinated um, with the oversized shirt. I am fascinated with blue shirts with stripes. This is actually, I feel it's too long, but I do see myself wearing it maybe open with a top underneath and a very comfortable trousers. This is really good shirt, just like a casual shirt, you know? This is size large, and I think the sleeves are okay. Um, I will always tuck it up like this um, I don't like wearing them down sorry for the shaky camera this makes it look better it looks quite cool I like the stripes on the shirt as you can see let me give you more look on the detail um, I'm not very fan of big fan of these kind of buttons I like them to be a little bit a little bit more elevated it's too basic but I like how it looks. I do see myself wearing it open, so I like it. I like this one. So always a long stripe so that you look slimmer and taller. That's the trick. That is the trick. So this is another high-waisted uh, tailored trousers. Very simple. Um, 
I love also the cut of it and I love I prefer this to the grey one and I'm not sure I just want to keep one trousers because first of all these are not trousers for winter okay these are for summer they're very thin they're very light and also I feel like we're already in winter in London so I don't want to be keeping both and not wearing them until next year and I don't know how my body shape will be next year so please help me which one to choose please leave in the comments your uh, advice which one to keep the black or the grey I'll definitely follow your advice but I love this one's cut makes me look less casual and it's more versatile because it's a black I can wear it with so many things let's see okay forgot to say <laughs> I'm doing this so that you can see the trousers forgot to say this is size large okay maybe I need a bigger mirror too what do you think guys let me know in the comments I need a bigger mirror something that will take the whole side like that yeah maybe I need a bigger one so that you can see me better okay this or the grey okay somehow I found myself all dressed up in black <laughs> somehow <laughs> this is all me this is how I dress up so anyway I wanted to show you this card again I got I don't know if the image is clear it doesn't really show you the detail of the cardigan but I really 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 love the detail it's a knitted cardigan and it gives the vibe of like this classy Chanel cardigans and I love the golden buttons okay let me just return the camera because oh, okay that's cool that's fine okay it's looking good here yeah. so I like as you can see here the buttons and you can see also the detail of the knitted cardigan it's quite heavy cardigan though um, very very good quality and the detail goes all the way down and all the way around and the pockets like it's a fake pocket it's not real pockets but I just love this one this one is definitely a keeper I love it and also just want to say all these things look perfect for me it's just Anyway, let me just take off this and I'll let you know what I think. Here we go, look much better now. So, just wanted to clearly explain to you what happened here. I was buying these stuff and I was thinking that the quality was going to be bad. It is not, it is not. I'm very surprised, I love it. I bought some stuff from their sustainable collection and also I bought other stuff from their premium collection. I can't really remember but you just have to go to the links in the description of the box below and go to the item and just see where it, what it is. Is it the sustainable one or is it the premium one? But I'm pretty sure that they're not that expensive because these whole things, all of these things were like around £200. I think it's still affordable, I think it's still a good quality, I think it doesn't look like H&M to be honest with you, really <laughs> this cardigan, I just can't even take it off, I love it. And if you're looking for something clean cut, simple, everyday life, that doesn't look like it's expensive or it's cheap, it's just like it looks perfect on you, that this is like the items you need to go to. So just go to the description below if you want to shop for them, I highly recommend that you try them at home because to be honest with you, I was not expecting it to be this good. <laughs> and I'm surprised that it's this good and now I'm trying to figure out what to keep or what to return because I feel like I want to keep everything anyway thank you so much for watching I hope this you enjoyed it um, I think you enjoyed this try and haul this is my first time trying this kind of things from H&M I think I bought stuff from H&M before but it was not like I bought it but it was without a purpose of kind of trying to see their quality it was just like filling a gap in my wardrobe I needed something quickly and I just went and bought it and I showed it to you maybe here I can't even remember if I did that but I think I feel like this is my first try and haul from H&M I felt before that there will be no added value for the viewer if I do the try and haul for H&M because I feel like I I feel like you guys would not be interested H&M is H&M but then I correct myself I was wrong I think that this has a lot of value to add to you to just hear that I'm saying to just hear me say that like it's really good good quality so I stand by what I said it is very good quality if you sell it right it doesn't look like it's H&M <laughs> so trust me and yeah I hope you enjoyed this haul uh, if you have any questions just leave them down below in the comments 
and um, please don't forget to like and subscribe that helps me a lot to continue making this video and I love you all for supporting me because I've seen all of you watching my videos so leave in comments I love you so much thank you for the support and I will see you in my next video stay safe and share if you care